one of the things that is causing a lot of trauma. And, you know, as an Ascended Master, you have to deal with it because um, it's the only way these people that are on a lower vibration understand. You know, they this is their natural habitat. But you see, they don't know how much it's affecting people that truly do want to grow. But you see, there's a lot of people, they just don't really want to take um, personal accountability. Okay, and then... When people do, they either take it later on, accountability, or, you know, they just don't know how to take full accountability in their life in general. And it's annoying because it's like they take accountability when life is hitting them, okay? That's another thing that I have strange feelings with is people be like, I'm sorry, because, you know, God finally showed me a lesson. I'm sorry and all this other bullshit. It's like, you know, you're taking late accountability. You know what I mean? Like, you. so it's like, it's crazy. They do that shit in relationships where um they will always say, you're the fucking wrong person, whatever it is. But the thing is, they'll say, they always say that. But then, you know, life will do a number. I mean, even friendships, toxic ex ass, you know, friendships, they'll come around years later and they'll be like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And it's like, you're only sorry because of the shit that you went through. You know, you should be actually taking personal accountability in your own hands. And actually, you know, some people, they'll be doing the fucking half-truth. They'll give the fucking half-accountability, okay? Because what that technique is called is a technique of a narcissist, okay? They're a person to where they will be like, yeah, I'm gonna just give this person half of the story without... But really, a lot of the shit that I did, I'm actually at fault for it, okay? They don't want to... So basically what it is is they still got some pride swallowed and, you know, swallowed up in them. And, you know, they don't want to admit it fully. People like that, they're going to face the biggest lessons because it's like, you know what? You're a fucking person that I don't want to be fucking with because, you know, if you can't be a person that can't take full accountability... I don't know what's going on with you. And you know what? People that do that shit, you just have God handle them. Okay? And I'm pretty sure they're not going through a pleasant time because of that. But yeah, you know, um, bless these children. Uh, bless their beautiful hearts. But this pride, this pride is, is awful. You know, and I haven't even heard them taking accountability with God or at least just praying about it and, you know, asking God, you know, even telling, like, telling God, they don't want to, I haven't even heard nothing, because if I, I did hear, because Marie hears everything, you know, God, she's connected to God, and, you know, God, he would have told her, okay, um, and that's how I'm able to, um, forgive a lot of people, because there's a good amount of people that I actually, you know, God has told me, he said, you know, he's, he or she, whoever it is, don't you worry, um, he's already had, this person's already had communication with me. So, you know, just let it go, Marie. Okay. So that's why I'm able to forgive people is because, um, see, they could have conversations with God and not have them directly with you. Okay. So that's why, um, in life, folks, if there's some people like a relationship, maybe you don't want to do some explaining no more. Okay. Um, that person could have had some explaining with God. So make sure you get with that conversation okay make sure you communicate with him on that but yeah honey it does piss him off pisses off but don't don't sweat it okay just smile and keep your spirit high